the awesome Sergio Aguero in action for you here as the top scorer in the league, remember, and it's live. A warm welcome to you all to South London, Selhurst Park, the home of Crystal Palace Football Club. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Premier League football we have for you, it's coming right up. It's Crystal Palace against Manchester City. Yeah, we've got buzz around this ground, full house, a lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Number 24, Gary Cahill. Number 3, Patrick Van Arnhem. Number 9, Jordan Ayew. Number 8, Jakku Kayate. Number 18, James McArthur. Number 10, Andrus Townsend. And number 15. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Keita is in goal. Luka Milivojevic plays with Cheku Kuyate in midfield. And just one up front for them today. Manchester City's lineup today. The goalkeeper is Edison. Kevin De Bruyne starts. He was man of the match in his last game. In attack, Sergio Aguero starts. He's been in tremendous form recently. Thank you, Selhurst Park. Enjoy the game. Here we are at the start of the match. One of their better passes, and he's given it away here. It's a bit lazy in possession. Sergio Aguero. De Bruyne cut out the pass. Silva. Mares, no way through for the shot, blocked. David Silva with the corner, dealt with the danger. Looking to steal the ball off him, but he's very composed. Leading the scoring chance in the league, Manchester City. Well, they play such an open, expansive game, it does leave them vulnerable at times, but they've just been outscoring the opposition. In from Mares. He has cleared it well. Here's Aguero. Now Mares. Here's David Silva probing the pass. Keep it did well to Rick. Oh, they opened the scoring here. It's a good start. It's a flying start, really. This is certainly a poacher's effort. The way he's just latched onto it quickly. The way he's got there ahead of the defenders. Different angle on it here. Well, it's Manchester City in front. Manchester City go. Number 21, Gavin Silver. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Got the ball, and they're going at the opposition with speed. Chance to get the ball in the box. Can he pick somebody out with this pullback? He's got it away, and that's what you have to do. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. Kyle Walker. Working the opposition over a little bit here with their passing. Only partially away from danger. Getting the ball back and thinking attack straight away.
just throwing his body into the way of the shot. Well, let's hear from Alan McAnally about a goal at Molyneux. It's a goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. 20 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Here's Kevin De Bruyne. Mares. Walker. It's De Bruyne. And the referee lets them go on. Advantage played by him. Well, suddenly they could be on the counter-attack. The break is definitely on. Fender blocks the cross. Silva. Sterling. And now here on the attack is Aguero. Excellent defensive tackle. Intercepted well. Here's Sterling. Aguero. Sterling. Still dangerous here off the goalkeeper. James MacArthur, James Tompkins, over the top of the defenders, and he could be in here. And they've cut it out. He's given the ball away here, unnecessarily. Made the tackle. Now Mares. Milivojevic, blocked off the pass there. Well, the team unable to find the pass there. They ran into a strong challenge, to be fair. Aguero trying to steer it through. David Silva, well taken goal, and a good possession for them now. Now they're two in front. <laughs> Goalkeeper was reaching for it, and it did actually touch him on the way in. I think there was just too much power on the ball and the shot for him to get a strong enough touch. Restarting at 2 0. Manchester City ball, number 21, Gafford Silva. Good defensive clearance there. No surprise to see City ahead in the possession stakes. No wonder they're winning. With that possession, they've taken their chances. They've played some lovely football to be comfortably on top here. David Silva leading the opposition. A merry dance here. Well, you've only got to look at the screen to see how successful, how positive he's been around goal. He's been so effective and got on the score sheet as well. Superb performance. Going forward with real purpose now. Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. Doing. Your timing has got to be spot on with those side hooks. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? Well, here we go again, and they can't wait to get the ball back from the kickoff and try and get another one. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Manchester City on the attack in a wide position. Well, that was disappointing. They could have made more. And here's the shot. Saved well by the goalkeeper. Manchester City gets given the corner here.
De Bruyne's delivery. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Easy save for Guaita in goal. And the referee has signaled for half-time. 3-0 is the scoreline at this point. Well, the scoreline reflects what has been a totally one-sided first 45 minutes. We've seen some superb football from this winning team at the moment, and if they can continue that, how many more goals can they get? really was a very one-sided first half and the team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now. Sergio Aguero. It's De Bruyne. Keeper's got good distance with that kick. Silva. Into the attacking third. Looking to win it back. Well, he seemed to see a pass there that none of us could see from where we're commentating from. Just a little nudge to nudge you in the direction of what's coming up on EA Sports for you. Our coverage of the Premier League fixture, Crystal Palace, they'll be facing Arsenal away from home. Yeah, really looking forward to this one. Uh, I think we're going to see some good football. Looking to attack the cross in numbers. It's a good lead, but the header too high. Yeah, unlucky. Give him another chance. I think he'll tuck that away. To be replaced by number 11, Wilfred Zaha. It's a very good interception. Ah, he'll feel good about that. A really strong and clean tackle. Looking ahead, Alan, Manchester City's next game. Yeah, they're playing Aston Villa, aren't they, in their next match? So much at stake, and I think it will be tense and tight. He screened the ball well there, and that will clear the danger. Can he finish it now? Zaha. Oh, what a tackle to break up the play. Mendy. He fancies his chances of getting past these players. Put through by Raheem Sterling. Hasn't held it, the goalkeeper. Well, at this rate, we could be in double figures. Continue to create chances at a fantastic rate. No strikers, I'm sure, have never had so many opportunities. Saved by the keeper, but not decisively. Now Mares, Kyle Walker. It's with De Bruyne. Sergio Aguero. Bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Joel Ward. But he's caught offside. You can see what he's trying to do. It's all about the timing of the run. This is where substitutes are important. Who and when? Substitution for Manchester City coming off the pitch. Number two, Kyle Walker to be replaced by number 27, Howell Cancello. Silva out into the wide areas now. Here's David Silva. Comfortable for the keeper. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Now De Bruyne. David Silva. Great chance. 
point could have made more of that. Substitution for but it's only a goal kick. Coming off the pitch, number 10, Andres Townsend, to be replaced by number 7, Maximilian Meyer. And the player being replaced is David Silva. Outstanding in this game. Wonderful to watch. He took those two goals superbly well. Well, let's hear from Alan McAnally about a goal in that Wolverhampton Wanderers game. It's a second goal for Southampton. 72 minutes played. 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. Oh, the attack has come in near post. Made the save. Good to add. Got his body in front of the opponent. Cleverly done. Through ball from Aguero. Oh, that will be a free kick for Manchester City. He's a very good individual. Saw that coming and intercepted. Got the ball and they're going at the opposition with speed. Still countering here. Mendy. It's with De Bruyne. Aguero. Gunduan. Sergio Aguero. Now Mares. Here's Aguero. Drew everything behind that shot and frustrated that it wasn't quite on target. Well, if he keeps getting in those kind of areas, I'm sure he'll score pretty soon. Sheku Kuyate. Any danger to the goal has gone with that clearance. So not much time left at all. What does this mean, Alan, for their next game? Well, Crystal Palace go up against Arsenal after this, and uh, they just haven't kicked the ball in anger. They've been poor. It's a shot. Fantastic save. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number 26, Riyad Mahrez, to be replaced by number 19. Put in by De Bruyne, only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. Seven minutes to go. Now Zaha, Milivojevic, Penteke, James MacArthur. That's a tremendous piece of play. Going forward with real purpose now. Got the ball back. He does need to get rid of it here. Stolen the ball in the attacking third, too. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. Sergio Aguero. Sane. Well, that's a lovely piece of skill. Well, disappointment for the losing team, but I'm afraid the winners deserve this margin, which has been confirmed by this very late goal. Yeah, it's been a, a walkover. You don't often get games like this at this particular level, but so one-sided. Well, it's a tough game for the team that are trailing. City They're game. out of the contest, really. They're just playing for pride. They're really being torn apart. Sometimes being a favourite in a match can weigh heavily. Expectational. Well, that's it. The final whistle. Oh, we've seen a game here, Alan, where one team has had the ball and the other team hasn't. There was a golfing class out there today, which was surprising given the two sets of players. I wasn't expecting it. They're keeping this very good run going, and they've got goals again, which is their stock in trade, Alan, isn't it, really, the visiting team? Yeah, they can't stop scoring away from home. There's just something about this side that produces chances, produces goals. Thank <laughs> you.